Hey guys, and welcome back to Firewatch. Right, so in the last episode, we pissed off some naked teenagers, and by the looks of things, they destroyed my cabin. Oh, they chucked that through the window, and it landed right at the bottom of there. It was so harrowing. Anyway, today, the phone lays are... Phone lays? Phone lines are out, and we have to go, uh, well, find out why. So, out... We go. Pick up my bag, slam it on my back, and let's get down there. Right, so I've got to go back through the cave that we found uh, yesterday. And, whoops. See how far I got. Oh, yeah, last time uh, there was also some random dude shining a torch in my face. Uh, no idea who it was. Mysterious stranger. Wait, what was that? Is it that? Oh, oh crap. Anyway, um... Um, I can't remember the way. Wait, where's the porta potty? The porta potty should be assistant. No, that's not it. Wait, there was an outhouse. Who is this? It, wait. There it is. There it is. It's over there. I've got to go down here. Oop. Oh, God. If only I could jump. Right, so I've got to go. Yeah, this way. Down here. And yeah, I kind of destroyed this area. Drop down. Hi. Whoop. Boom. And next. Drop down. And whoop. Boom. Right. Uh, yeah, I came up the difficult way. So we're taking the ramp access. Right, let's go down here. Get ourselves way back to the cave. Wait, does it get no the caves down here, isn't it? I never remember. I've got the memory of a goldfish. And apparently goldfish's memories are better than people think. Uh Yeah, that was a completely totally useless piece of information. Look at that. That looks nice. It's misty. I'm going into a cave, and it's misty. Oh, it's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder, though, right? Yeah, they are. Whoop. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? Uh. Uh, you know, um, I don't know. I used to just spend. <laughs> Still can't get in. Dog. What type? A beagle. We got him from the pound. That's great. Hey, can you hold on a sec? Yeah. Uh, sure. Just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms Ooh, up. Pretty. Hey yo. Oh. I don't think so. Why have you? Okay, good. What? I didn't say anything. No, uh, I don't hey, think your he has button any is idea. still down. I'm absolutely sure. Would you? All right. I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. Hmm. Hey, sorry about that. Anyway, Bucket's a cute name. You, um, you owned him with someone? Uh, who was that? Who was who? I, I don't think he has any idea. What, what was that? Were you talking about me? Uh, what? You left your button pressed or something. Henry, that call was work. I was just talking to... Actually, it's not really your business. Why are you freaking out? I'm not freaking out. Good. I'm gonna go quiet for a little bit. Call me if it's important. Ooh. She's annoyed. Well, I don't care. Right, I pissed it off and I can't remember where I'm going. Okay, no problem. Uh, right, I'm supposed to be going some. Uh, am I going the right way? I'm supposed to be going north. Um, well, this is kind of east, northeast. Survey communication lines. Well, I can't go on over there because I don't have a rope. So yeah, I'm. I'm guessing we've got to go down here. Right, run. Ah, here we go. 
Right. Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. I heard a noise. Boom, 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 boom. Not entirely sure if it was in the game or in real life. Anyway, let us continue further down here. So we've got to have a look at these things and follow them along, see what we can find. A little bit of exploring while I'm on my way. Oh, that sounds kind of scary. Right. We've got another pole here. Another pole. Uh, another pole. Another pole, another pole. And we've got something over here. Right, let's have a look over here. We have... An old outhouse. Is there anything in? Uh, hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I mean, uh, I'm in the right area? I do believe. Uh, the comms wire runs for quite a ways. Follow it all the way to the top of Beartooth Point, and if it's not damaged, you can loop around back home. Cool. Right, let's have a look here. Supply cache. One, two, three, four. Open sesame. What do we have? <gasps> a hat. Huh. Found an old hat from a Korean war vet. You'd be surprised how many former service members take this gig. Cool. Oh, makes sense. I imagine if you've been through war, you probably can't get enough silence. That's actually a bloody good point. Let's have a look at the old cabin. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello? Okay, then. Okay. Oh, shit went down in here. Ruined firefinder. Oh, trash. Okay. Not going down here. Do we have anything down here? That I can take. Destroyed guitar. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Don't need that. Anything useful? Ah, oh, open. Nothing! Cool. Brilliant. Uh, what about over here? No. Burned bed. Ah, oh, I was hoping there'd be something to play around with. Not to worry. It does look like it exploded, though. Anyway. Uh, let's get back on trail. Um, right, so I have to follow these. So we're going north now, so... I'm thinking probably north up here. Oh, right, let's get me a thing. Yep. Hop over the log. Boop. Yeah. Right, we can see. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ah, there. That looks suspiciously broken. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. Uh... Right. You know, for a wilderness, there seems to be quite a lack of wildlife. He says, hearing something. I don't know what the hell it was, but something freaked me out. Uh, down here? No. Ah. Ooh, a cache. Or something. Let's go over there and see what there is that we can play with. All oh, these wonderful toys I keep finding. Alright, let's go around here. So that's definitely... Oh, there. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Really? 
awesome could find. It's like, I don't know, a mile and a half east of me. You just follow the trail up the hill, you can't miss it. I'll go see what the damage is. Cool. First things first, though, we are having a look in the supply cache. One, two, three, four. Hell yeah. Cool. Copy information. Nice. What do we have there? A note. Whoop. Okay, Dave. Hey, yo. Got your note about needing to talk, and sorry I didn't track you down. Been looking for you all day. Figured you'd be out near Canyon helping those grad students, but I guess not. I don't even know how I could really help anyway. We're co workers, you know. Amigos profesionales. If you need someone to throw back a case with and go time traveling, Ron's the guy, but I'm not great with life stuff. You get it? Later on, Ron. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll keep it. Why not? What do we have in here? Flowers, a board. Ooh, a board. Ah. Uh, hup, hup, uh, 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 just hit myself in the face. With a board. Drop. We have... Six feet down under. Oop. Uh, ah. Okay, that sounds different. Drop. Anything else? Anything else? No. Okay. At least I've got a map and uh, a board. So, how am I getting up there? Um, do I, yeah, I'm going to have to go around that. Uh, back the way I came. Down here. Push. Follow the road round. Well, maybe, maybe not this way. It's, uh, yeah, this is largely pointless. Right, so I keep following the power lines. Oh. Oh. Always been pissing them out with beer. Hey, so there are beer cans all over the ground up here leading up the hill. That's annoying. Yeah, thing is, there were a bunch down at that campsite yesterday. Coincidence, maybe? I don't think so. Same brand, everything. These okay. fucking kids. These fucking kids. How could these girls be so stupid? Trust me, I never underestimate the stupidity of a drunk teenager. Also, I never underestimate the balls of a drunk young woman. Have Oops. you been one? Ah. Uh, okay. Long drop down. Oop. Look behind you. Long drop. Well, I hopped down a drop and now I can't climb back up. That is really? a pickle. I can just not keep really. hiking, can but just I figured I should let you know here. in case I get myself trapped out here. Hmm, how adventurous of you. That's, I've been that's... doing a lot more climbing out here than I expected. Oh. Well, keep your radio charged. I'd hate to one day find a skeleton with an orange backpack at the bottom of a ravine. I thought that was a mushroom. Wow, there's a can there as well. Jesus, how much did these kids drink? I know there were two of them, but how drunk can you get on like about? Well, I've seen what. Oh, they had whiskey too as well. I guess that explains it. Can't beat a nice glass of whiskey now and then. Or a bottle. Cool. Pick and pick up. Uh. Oh, you can clear it. Damn it. Okay. Clear up. Pick up. Clear up. Go to hell. Uh, uh, have you really been... Oh. Right. Okay. I can't... Can't get to it. I think those are my underpants. End of wire. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was...
cut deliberately. I knew it the moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Hmm. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm. You can chase them with me underpants. Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am gonna need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Okay. Now, I'm slightly worried about this thing floating around over here. Because you can see the trees behind it. I have no idea what's going on there. Probably just a slight level of detail bug. Anyway. We are having a beer can. Oh, clear up. I could drop down or I could walk down. I'm walking because there is another can over here. Let's pick up the can, clean it up. Oh, I really ought to go back and clear up the others. I'll do that eventually. Um, okay, another one. Jesus Christ! I'll say this about them, they can definitely chug. Keep going. Right, we're looking for anything else. Wait, this way? This looks like another way back. Blocked trail. Uh. I've got an overgrown trail here. Yeah, that'll happen. So I'm screwed when it comes to getting past it? Mm-hmm. Screwed until you clear it yourself, yeah. Great. Well, if I come across some tools, I'll add groundskeeping to my ever-increasing list of responsibilities. Hmm. Uh, why don't you just walk round it? Seriously. Right, let's carry on. We have to find ourselves some teenage girls and scare them. Being a guy with freakishly huge hands, I don't think that's really going to be a problem. Uh, okay. Long drop down. Yep. Boosh. Sweet, right. We need to... Two Fox Fire Lookout. That way, oh, there is a supply drop. I'm going to this supply drop because I think this is the one that um, was floating in midair. I think so. What do we have here? 60 feet supply drop. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah, but this is the one. It's a similar shape and everything. All right, one, whoops, one, two, three, four, bing. And we're open. What do we have? We have. Cool. Uh. Shit all. Brilliant. Okay. Was that it? What's, what's down here? Anything? Oh. A bit of a drop. Right, let's get back to where we were going. We were going all the way back to our... Uh, hideout thing. Might as well do what we're supposed to be doing. Oh, what was that? No idea. Um, hmm. Not much going on at the moment. So we've definitely got to go down here. Um, can we go down there? Nope. 
Let's keep wandering. Oh, shit. What's that? What's that? That's a backpack. Who's leaving the backpack around? Oh, oh, really? Oh. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Yeah, I'm, I've got an eye on that. Swipe. Swipe. Yay. Cool. Brian Goodwin. What do we have? Cool. Camera. And a rope. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them. In decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's, there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank nice. You, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Cool. Uh, he was a lookout? <laughs> yeah, kinda, I guess. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad Ned three summers ago. Great kid. You can oh, bring dear, children out here? No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Why? Where did they go? I don't know. I never really hit it off with old Ned. And, um, one day they were just gone. Sucks. Anyway, so it goes. Have, uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a photodome employee. I don't know. I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Oh. They've started another fire. At least I think they've started another fire. There's a definite fiery looking thing over there. I see a really thin plume of smoke. Yeah, I see it too. A thin plume like this is either a new fire or a campfire. Campfire? You, you think it's them? I reckon so. It okay. looks like it's to the southwest of me. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let me know if it's getting any larger. Will do. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Oh, really? Yeah, it's a raptor claw. Oh, really? She's not bothered. Right. Looks like we're heading that way. Hey, hmm. Sorry about snapping at you earlier. Um, I thought about it and... Yeah, I suppose that must have sounded kind of weird when you heard me take that other call. Plus, you're just out here in your own head. Trust me, I know how it is. So, did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. I'm actually married. But you're here. Yeah. Everything's fine, just, you know, we're taking some time apart, getting some fresh air. A little change. Yeah. Mm. All right, well, we can just... Leave it at that. Thanks. Whoa. This place got decimated. There's definitely been a fire or something here. Um, do I go this way? Oh, do I go I that way? Let's have a look. time getting this fucking flapjack off his ass and out to repair that wire. Oh, god damn it. Reply, flapjack. Excuse me, flapjack? You know, like a loser. A chotch. I really don't, but I do now. Well, the next time you're at a bar and some banker steps on your foot so he can order his crappy martini, you've got just the name to use. What, Flapjack? Hey, 
Flapjack. Why don't you wait your turn before I bounce your face off a dumpster? It's beautiful. Okay. Flapjack. Flapjack. I like Flapjack. Delicious. Oh, I can't go that way. Okay. Um... Okay, let's carry on through the charred remains of this forest. It looks very different. Shit, I heard something. The cracking of something. Ha, <laughs> no idea. I keep exploring around, expecting to find like a, a little secret somewhere, but I haven't found anything yet. What if there are actually like collectibles or little secrets you can find? I do like the caches, but it'd be nice to actually pick up a few things I take it dotted you around. The Forest Service's big recruiting effort when it comes to you know how the hell you ended up out here. Ooh. I saw the job in the paper and figured, you know, what the heck? What the heck? I've got no ties and no life. Better go spend what's left of it in utter loneliness. Uh, something like that? Yeah, thanks to last summer, the bump in Forest Service budget actually allowed for us to advertise for the job. Glad it worked. What happened last summer that accounted for this, uh, windfall? Jeez. I mean, the federal government almost let Yellowstone National Park burn to the ground? Ring a bell? Yellowstone is, like, what, 15 miles away? Why would they do that? Well, the short story is that for 60 years, we got very good at not letting forest fires happen. And then about 15 years ago, they decided that forest fires in wilderness areas like Yellowstone should be left to burn. So that's what they did. I can't believe you didn't hear about this. There were reports that the entire park was gone. Dan Rather telling the country that President Reagan didn't care on the nightly news. I mean, what the hell's he gonna do? Smoke jump in and snuff one out for the Gipper? Mm -hmm. So what should they have done? I don't even know. By the time the Yellowstone folks realized the little fires weren't going to burn themselves out, a hundred thousand acres were gone. Jesus Christ. You know, people don't want to touch it, but we touch it every single day. But hey, I got a 30 cents an hour raise because we can't have another fiasco. Like the goddamn park can burn down again. I'm down in Thunder Canyon. I'm not seeing that smoke anymore. Oh, it's still burning away. Try heading west from where you are. If you loop past the lake, there should be a trail that'll take you further south. Thanks, that helps. Cool, right, so we're on our way again. Let's take the nice scenic route through here. I wish I could go under there. That looks like it could be a fun little bridge. I don't know if you used to like doing it when you were a kid, but stuff like that. <laughs> You know, little, just little overhangs. Always used to love just literally just going so under you know, them. I didn't mean to overstep Here's one. my bounds earlier when you brought up your wife. Let's go. Cool. I know you didn't. You were just making conversation. I appreciate it. So, tell me about her, if you want. Mm. She's a college professor. She's a PhD in biology, evolution, and stuff. Ooh, evolution. That's a risque subject in these parts. Man, she sounds sexy. She sure was. Where does she teach? Yale. Yale? Yep. The Yale. <laughs> Shit, Henry. She flew back and forth. I hated it. Yeah, I would too. Yeah. Anyway, that's her. Cool. Right, I think I'm going the right way. Um, I don't see the smoke. Uh, what's going on here? What's this? It's falling from the trees. I don't get it. I, I really have no idea what that stuff is. Oh, cache. Uh, one, two, three, four. 
get in. And what do we have now? T-shirt. Uh, I found a sweatshirt from the University of Eastern Colorado. Maybe it's one of the girls. I mean, it's been here a long time. There's a University of Eastern Colorado? I really don't think there is. Why would somebody make that up? Right, and then put it on a sweatshirt. The a weird place. <laughs> hey, note. Let's see. Uh, boom. Ron, got some bad news back home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say, though, budgets being what they are? Did you get my note about what went down in Wapiti? Sheriff isn't too pleased with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. Wish you would have been there. Uh, I guess you must have got hung up, Dave. P.S. Amigos in Spanish and professional is, is Italian. Cool. I'm keeping that. Don't know who they are, but... Might as well keep the letters. Let's have a look. Um... Whoa, that thin plume of smoke seems freaking huge from here. Oh, wow, that's that's gorgeous. I'll be having a click. No, I don't need that yet. Right, let's have a look. Um, I, is that a duck? There's a duck. We found some wildlife. Wait, what's that? Oh, it's just more. There's a slightly disturbingly sitting there doing nothing, duck. Ah, doing duck all. Right. Let's have a look through here. That's pretty. Uh, I'm guessing we are, we're going to have to go down here. Oh, wait. While I'm down here, I can actually pick up some of those cans. That those uh, lasses left. Might as well. Keep it nice and clean and tidy so that, uh, you know, the ecosystem doesn't get fucked up. Uh oh, I've got myself into a bit of a... Where, where am I going? Man, you had a full-on PhD at home. <laughs> part of me thinks that would be insufferable, but then there's another part of me that can't help but indulge the whole hot-for-teacher thing. You know, heavy petting in the book stacks. Furtive glances during lecture. Okay, okay, cool it down. Ooh, not sure we can stop this train now. <laughs> you are ridiculous. Come on, I'm just teasing. I know that academia is a pain in the ass. Professors go wherever they can get tenure. Yes, they do. Right, so I'm picking them up. Can I actually get there? I think I've got to go this way. Any more beer cans? Oh my god, yeah, there are. Beer can! Beer can. Any more beer cans? I'm thinking hopefully some sort of achievement or something like that by picking them up. No idea. Right, we have to get over there somehow. Is there a way up here if I can go? No, not yet. There's this little area. Is this actually leading me anywhere or am I just going to hit a dead end? I'm thinking dead end. That's where I went down. Right. Rope hook. Click. And woo. Uh repel. Down we go. Uh, 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 uh. Yeehaw. Right. I think I'm kidding aside, what happened with the professor? If you guys had so much fun, when did it stop? When she got sick, that's when it stopped. Oh, my my God, I, I, I mean, I mean, fuck, what, what happened? We can talk about it later. Okay, <laughs> okay, Henry. Um, what's her name? Julia. That's a nice name. Hmm. Right, so we have another cashier here. Oh, oh god. One, two, three, four, bing. Anything good in here? Copy information. 
We have a missing person. Okay. Whoop. Mitch Michaels. Wow, he's been missing a hell of a long time. Uh, keep that. What about this? Does that do anything? No, the pine cones everywhere. What's going on with the pine cones? I mean, surely there's a abundance of lush woods. Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? Nope. I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Okay. So, ah, I find, I found the stream. Right, let's carry on down here. This is actually pretty freaking gorgeous. Right, um, carry on. Where are we going? Down here? Can I go up here? Hopefully. Or does it just take me... Yes, well, we found this. Whoa, birds! I see birds! Actually, birds! Uh, what's that down there? Is that... Oh, that looks like a bit of a tree. Okay. Ooh, nice. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Even those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. They've had beer. Ah. Damn. Um. That is slightly worrying. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Hmm. Definitely strange. Let's have a look over here. Nah, I think I better go through that little area over there. I think that may be where I have to go. I mean, obviously it is. But I thought there might have been something around there, just in case. Just let's have a look. Anyway, there should be. Oh. I heard something then. Ah, here we go. Campfire. We have a campfire. Ah, found my sheets. The girls stole them? Yeah, but the thing is, their entire campsite is wrecked. What happened? Uh, Honestly, it, it looks like it could have been a bear. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I, I need to be honest with you. If I find a dead body out here, I'm going to be sick. Well, don't yak. Just look around and let me know what you find. Actually, you've got that camera, right? It might be a good idea to get a few snaps, just in case. Yeah, good thinking. Cool. Bang. Uh. How's this? Bing. All right, we've got a note here. Okay. Okay, dear psycho, I hope you're fucking happy. We're leaving and we're going to find the police or whatever and tell them about how you creeped on us at the lake and then came and destroyed our campsite and all of our stuff. So, and stealing panties is gross out. You're probably a mental fucking axe murderer and are so going to jail. I hope it was worth being a jerk over some fireworks, dick. Okay. Oh, they're gone, for sure. How can you tell? Well, the girls left someone, me, I guess, a note. Well, what's it say? They're threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, uh, did you? No. No, well, hey, I didn't do this. Okay, someone or something went to town here, but it wasn't <laughs> me. Because I told you to scare them, not assault them. I didn't. Of course I didn't. I just threw their stereo in the lake. <laughs> yeah, I really wish you wouldn't have done that. <laughs> this is, 
I don't know, weird as hell, but it wasn't me. It's, it's okay. I believe you. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. We really don't know, but they're gone. There's no way to call the cops. They're not coming back, and we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too. Okay. Hey, day three. Are we... Are we back at the lookout? That will be a yes. Yeah. Find boards downstairs to patch the window. Ah, oh, I certainly will do, but not quite yet. Well, this has been quite a long episode. Oh, come on. Yeah. Um, what do you look like? Wreck it, Ralph. Are you asking? Because I'm horribly superficial. Hmm. Well, I get confused for Burt Reynolds all the time. Oh, is that so? <laughs> Women <laughs> seem to be impressed. a similar musk. Hey, you asked. Okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. It's hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC or whatever they say. Oh my god, you are the whitest man. Wow. <laughs> I don't need a spotting scope for that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? You're perving on me. Uh, I don't know. I like to look nice, usually. Well, I try now, I guess. Hmm. Had a bit of a schlubby period, did we? Yeah, a good 25, 30 years, yeah. But, um, now you'll put on a, a clean shirt? Yeah. Well, I, I have one that I got for Christmas, actually. Just, um, it's navy with white buttons, but I, I like it. I don't wear it that much, though. Well, it sounds just perfect. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. What do I see? Uh. Hmm. Uh. Ah, thick beard. Thick Screw it. Beard. Oh, have you always had a beard? For a while, yeah. All right, perfect. I want to know about your eyes. Get out oh, of Jesus here. Christ! I'm drawing you. I need to know. Your what? Is is that okay? Uh. Don't, don't answer. I'm gonna do it regardless. Fine. Your eyes. Tell me. Okay. Uh, happy. They're happy. I think. I mean, I've been told they look happy. Julia told you that, huh? Look, I don't know how to describe eyes. Happy is good. That's good. Okay, got it. Thank you, Henry. You get what you need. Absolutely. Cool. What's going on over there? There's something in the sky. It's just floating there. It's probably another cashier box. But anyway, uh, we'll solve that mystery when we get to it. Uh, yeah, this has been a slightly longer than uh, normal episode. But, yeah, I think I'm going to do a day per episode uh, from now on. It seems to work quite well. Uh, so yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this episode and I shall see you next time, but until then, take care. Oh, and don't piss off teenage girls. <laughs>